Right, this is Seth and I'm Craig. Today we're going to be doing a finger style acoustic song. So, it's going to be a bit of a quicker one. It's probably going to be like a two or three parter. Uh, it looks a lot harder than it actually is. Once you get into doing it, it's really simple. It just looks and sounds a bit complicated. So, we'll get straight in here. That song's by Kansas, Dust in the Wind. They actually made this song, they were doing a finger exercise and they just decided to turn it into a song. So, it looks really difficult, but most of that song I'm only playing two chords. It's all, all the fancy stuff happens in your right hand this time. So, start off, we don't care what chord's being played up here whatsoever. You could play it with nothing, you could play it with like a D chord, a C chord. I'll play a C just because that's what they play in the song, that's what we're going to be learning, so C chord. 3rd fret 5th string, 2nd fret 4th string, and 1st fret 2nd string. So, seconds. So, all fancy stuff happens here, and I'll, I'll take you through this a bit at a time, and you're just going to work on this, and then on Thursday we'll do the actual parts of the song. So. Start off, you've got your thumb and your middle finger. I'm using my middle finger for it anyway. You could use your ring finger. I'm just using middle finger. So, so you're going to take the fifth string with your thumb and the second string with your middle finger, and you're just going to go pluck both of them at the same time. If I can get that to the camera. So. Both of those at the same time. So pluck, and then your thumb's going to pick the fourth the fourth string. So both, fourth, and you can use your middle finger or your first finger to pick the third string. So, so the next bit is so do both strings, then fourth, third, then you're going to pick, uh, pick the fifth string with your thumb, and then the second string with your middle finger. So that's all it is. You're just going to practice that as much as you can, get it to the point where you're not even thinking about playing it. So if you want to practice that as much as you can, then the song itself is just that for the full song. So that finger pattern does not change. The only difference is it's a wee bit faster when I'm playing it. So you want to practice that as much as you can, then you want to speed up a bit. Practice it, speed it up. And then once you've got that down, then the next bit's really easy because it's mostly just a C chord. You're just changing a couple of fingers here and there. But that's all for the lesson today. You're just going to practice that finger style pattern because it applies to this song, but it applies to any acoustic song you want to play. You could just do that part. acoustic song you could just put that finger style pattern over, even an electric doesn't matter. You could use this anywhere but we're just going to use it for that song so 
get practicing on that and the next part of the lesson will be up on Thursday. See ya.